this is the energy vibration reading for all um for all the the hair sign people for the Aquarius Gemini Libra for the month of February. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Please like, share these videos, and thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up to these videos. Thumbs up to these videos. I want to say to each and every person, um, thank you for the likes, shares, and support. Um, and uh, please, this video is going to be approximately 50 minutes, so please download this video. Um, and I uh, get the on demand, it's just a dollar 99. The February readings are out. Check out the week readings, and I'm live on Fridays. Please cross watch because it's going to be very important. So, here we have, and here we're looking at um, the month of uh, February for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say uh, for the air sign people i want to say thank you so much for being here thank you for the wonderful energies remember the sun sign people are here and they are the people who were born um um 5 a.m till um 6 p.m okay and the moon people are the people who were born after six o'clock till 5 a.m in the morning okay so the sun people what we're seeing here um, for the Sun people we are seeing that the Sagittarians are there coming up for them and Aries Sagittarius and Aries so these are people who you are positively connected with and the Aquarians okay so the Aquarians are here and what is happening is that there are going to be some significant transition that is going to be coming up in your lives all you ear sign okay um, the effect of the Aquarians is here especially the Sun Aquarians there's a lot that is going to be going on there is going to be some luck coming in for the Sun Aquarians okay um, your own energy is here um, your own planetary energy um, and um, what I should advise you guys to do is um, be clear because um, what is transpiring is that with the energy of Pluto and Uranus that means that a lot is going to be released remember that the full moon is on the 20th of the month so the 20th of February is the full moon you're dealing with some scorpions but you're going to have some luck you're dealing with some scorpions but you're definitely going to have some luck now we have the energy of the moon and Pluto now whatever is transpiring with the people who were born um, 7 p.m. to 5 a.m. in the morning Pluto is here and it's going to be releasing certain aspect from you and Mercury is also here so there's definitely um, things that is going to be happening things that are going to be transpiring in your life which you have to be aware of and we're going to be looking deeper to see where these things are going to affect you guys and how are you going to be dealing with them because it is um a year of transition that is coming up for you guys okay so um let's see what is going to affect you what's this chakra remember to heal your chakras by calling up the angels and guides to touch open and activate all of your 12 chakras and ask them to sing over your chakras okay and um, you can call upon Serasmus Bay and um, you can access this also okay so let's look and see what's happening um, to the Sun sign people okay you're dealing with a Sagittarius Sagittarius is going to bring expansion in your life um, the, the Aries are all of vanity so be careful um, who you're dealing with because the Aries are all of vanity this is what is coming in the Aries are all of vanity so be aware of that you Sun sign people then we have bittersweet you Aquarian so something definitely is going to be leaving your life something is definitely going to happen to you Sun sign Aquarian so be aware of that okay so for the Sun sign people the people who were born 5 a.m. To six um, to seven p.m. 
um, what is transpiring and what is happening is that um, some of you are going to be dealing with the, the Sagittarius and the Sagittarians are going to be uh, bringing expansion into your world okay Sagittarius are going to be bringing some expansion into your world then the people the Sun people who are dealing with the Aries it's going to be the Aries are all in for vanity okay it's all about the materialistic world for the Aries whatever is transpiring with Aries is all about materialistic world you can see this already here now for the Aquarians um, the Sun sign Aquarians it's going to be a bit too sweet it's all about healing call upon Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael for the healing because it's all about the blue and whenever the energy of the blue comes up it's all about the even from Archangel Raphael because the um, vanity um, is obviously a sense of healing that is going to be transpiring okay now let's look at the moon people we have Pluto the planet Pluto coming up so Pluto is going to bring some it's going to be removing things that no longer serve you and bring you some miracles so always call upon the universal angels for a miracle if you're in a situation um, ask for divine intervention and healing and protection and call upon the universal angels for divine intervention in all the situations that is going around you and pray ask the universal guides and angels for prior mercury he is here and mercury has the, uh, the the help of the impasse the impasse so with mercury because you guys are fireside you can materialize anything in your life and with mercury being here it's all about impasse you're you're in you're sitting in a moment of impasse where you're waiting for something to happen if you look at the fire sign they're all about healing because they're realizing bittersweet they're realizing now what does Uranus bring for the air sign acceptancy okay Uranus bring acceptancy okay so it's all about this period for you guys it's all about discovery it's a wonderful energy coming up with discovery because it has to do with Jupiter and this is very good because what is there and what is transpiring is that with the planet of Jupiter it's going to help you to discover hidden talents hidden goal that you have which you were not aware of and uh, how you can use them to expand uh, um, in your life and this is going to be good now for the moon people the people who were born after 6 p.m. till 5 a.m. what is transpired is there a miracle is coming in a miracle is definitely coming in and um, um, for the people who have a Uranus in their birth chart and it's good to find out what's in your birth chart in a month you are going to be just accepting things as they are a lot of you are going to be having the energy where the scorpions or um, are coming out to help you guys see your enemies whether your enemies are the scorpions are coming out to let you guys see who your enemies are okay so let's see what is transpiring for expansion for expansion um, you're going to be building a strong foundation so the people who are going to be working with the Sagittarius you air sign people they're going to be teaching you how to build a strong foundation now some of you are going to be connecting with the Aries and connecting with the Aries in love so this is new love that is coming in there is someone who is a Aries who is going to enter your life but realize that this person is entering it because of vanity so be aware of this okay so it could be someone that is coming back from the past it could be um, an ex that is coming back from the past and they're coming in but they're coming in um, with um, a thinking of what they want so be aware of that the bittersweet that is coming in three of cups so it's a celebration but it's a bittersweet celebration okay it is a celebration but it's a bittersweet celebration whatever the situation is and whatever that was happening it has finally end but it's a bittersweet ending okay and um, it wasn't what you were looking forward for um, so it's going to affect the Aquarians and it's going to affect you air sign people with a career in, in your birth chart okay so be aware of that so check out to see um, if Aquarians is in your birth chart because there's going to be some bittersweet celebration okay it's going to be the ending of something but it's not going to be such a wonderful positive ending okay 
as we look at Pluto and this miracle what is Pluto telling us about this miracle for this air sign people um, the Knight of Cups okay so um, what is transpiring is that some of you could be dealing with a scorpion and um, there is a miracle there's a transformation there is something that is going to be releasing from this um, Pisces life whoever was um, having this Pisces down or whatever it was it could be that this Pisces this um, person the scorpion or um, a Pisces or a cancer is going to be helping you to bring something because um, they could be be removing out of your life or they could be removing out of your life to make space for someone who is better and someone who's good okay impasse mercury and impasse is here and it has to do with the nine of wands okay so something is definitely going to be leaving your life but you're going to be okay you don't need to worry about this because you're going to be definitely be okay things are going to be working out for you and things are going to be happening for you not to worry you are divinely protection protected let's look at um Uranus and acceptance so something definitely a shift is going to be coming in and it could be affecting you Aquarian so you just have to make the acceptance and accept whatever this ship brings in it could be mostly affecting the Aquarians because whatever is transpiring it's your hair and the Uranus is right beside you so if Uranus is in your planet um, you're going to be releasing something and you just have to access accept that it is you know that is the ending of something that is the, um what should happen that is the way out of a situation okay acceptance and um, some money is going to be coming through so um, this is good nine of Pentacles so whatever it is um, some of you could be dealing an eight of Pentacles okay so um, Jupiter is bringing you guys definitely some luck and the luck that Jupiter is bringing you is about doing something for yourself that is going to be very very um it's like discovering a, 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 a gift that you have you 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 are going you guys are going to be discovering a gift that you have in this February new um, full moon and by discovering this gift that you have it's going to help you to make a lot of money some of you, you it could be a, a lawsuit or it could be a situation it could be an unjust situation and um, money is going to be coming to you so accept this money whatever um, this money is accept it because uh, this money is going to be coming in for you guys okay really it's not a bad um, of, of this is not bad um, we have to go forward um, to basically see exactly what is transpiring but definitely I am NOT seeing this as uh, um, being very bad I'm seeing this as being very very positive so whatever this is it's going to be coming out in a positive positive way okay so um, that's um, uh, that's good news for you Aquarians okay um, it's definitely good for you not only Aquarians but um, for you hair sign people um, because this is a reading for all you air sign people okay I'm trying to get it before I can change so that everyone can um, I'm really trying to get it um, right so um, this is wonderful I'm wishing you guys really really a wonderful wonderful um, um, full moon and remember that uh, whatever the gifts or whatever you realize um, it could be a good supporting energy that is just going to be helping you um, to build on something um, in your life and this is going to be extremely positive because wonderful positive energies are here I want to say to you guys please like and share these videos and um, this is coming um, for the month of February from um, uh, 15